Oh, God damn, I missed you. And uh, to Dax's point, no better place in the world to be. But to Dax's point last night, the reception you guys gave FTR, it brought a tear to my eye as well, but for different reasons. I had to follow it. <laughs> but, like they said, boys, well deserved. So, I've been gone for a long time. And there's been some speculation as to why injuries, different plans, none of that's true. I don't know if it's because I'm in Toronto, I don't know if it's because I'm home. I'm a pretty private person, but I feel like I owe you all an explanation. Two months ago, two months ago, I lost my mom. And she would have been front and center like she has been at every other show if he, she was here tonight. But that woman, that woman is a perfect 10 in every way, shape, and form. Two blessings came out of that. Number one, we had time to say everything we ever wanted to say, to make her feel as loved as she possibly could. Most people don't have that luxury. The second blessing was that on this Mother's Day, she was the very first person to know that I was gonna be a father. So the way I see it, there's a guardian angel looking over my soon-to-be beautiful baby boy. So I've been pulled in a bunch of different directions, mentally and emotionally, but I knew that coming home, each and every one of you would show up, and God damn, did you ever. From the bottom of my heart, I will never, ever forget this day, and I have you all to thank for that. In this ring stands four men that I greatly admire. I admire them all as talents. I admire them all as men. Hey, Dax. And if I can be half the father that you are to Finley, then I'm gonna be okay. I love you, Canada. Thank you for having us. We will be back, A-E-W!